I'm so happy to see you. I am gonna do a weekly vlog. I'm gonna do a weekly vlog because I'm actually just sitting here. The dog is sleeping and I am starting to unpack my bag from New York. It is Monday. It is like five o'clock in the afternoon. It's been really tired after the traveling. My plane was a little bit delayed last night. So I didn't get home here until half past ten at night last night. So I got myself gave myself a little slack this morning allowed myself to sleep in and i've been editing some videos and i'm finishing up the vlog now but yeah i'm gonna take you along for the rest of the week i'm gonna hang out a little bit with ricardo i am gonna try and take a pool day tomorrow i'm gonna film this nail also is do you see that it's dying so i have a nail appointment on wednesday and i also ordered a couple of paintings like paintings like prints frame prints that i'm gonna have in the kitchen i've also ordered a print for the hallway that one is already here so we're gonna hang that one as well we're just gonna you know have a little chill spending a week at home vlog i do know we have some plans for the weekend as well but i don't know how long this is gonna be i have no idea but tag along for a weekly vlog where are you going honey are you done I bet he's going. I bet he's going to the bed. Yeah. He is officially in the bed. <laughs> we are at Best Buy. Say hi! My husband came back from work. We're at Best Buy because we are going to get a new... Do you say computer mouse? Is it called mouse? Oh, it's called mouse. Okay. Because <laughs> uh, mine... I don't know if it broke or if it's just glitching a little bit. It's not living its best life. So we're going to see if we can get a new one. Because it was really hard to work today with that one. I had to I had to borrow Ricardo's. So we're going to go into Best Buy. And then we're going to head into uh, Target. Because I want to find a floaty. Because I want to be by the pool. Living my best life. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Are you jealous? A little bit. <laughs> Okay, so I decided to get the razor, Basilisk. Basilisk? Basilisk? Basilisk. <laughs> That's what I said! No. <laughs> uh, I just got the, the regular one. I got the cordless one, but I didn't get it in colors or stuff. But I like how this one felt, so I'm gonna be using this one for a bit. So hopefully that will work out. But now we're heading to Target, so I can look at the floaties. Which is where? I think it's like this way. I think you have to like cross the road, if I'm not mistaken. What do you call these? A cooling bag? Mm -hmm. You call that? A cooling mm -hmm. bag? <laughs> a pool floaty and a kitty cat that's really curious. And yeah, I don't know. Ice blocks, garbage bags, deodorant, a scissors because we broke the pair we had. And now I'm having melon. Mm. Heading out to meet our neighbor and walk the dog a little bit. He's so excited. He's so happy to get out. Are you excited too, kitty cat? <laughs> Anyways, we're walking out. Mm, I bought some, did I say that? I bought some paintings for this wall today. I'm very excited. You're gonna have to lock, sweetie. I'm meeting Melon. Tuesday. 
feel much more rested today than I did yesterday. <laughs> so that is great. I am actually going to start my day, well, with coffee, obviously. It's getting done now. And then I'm going to start my day because I need to order a couple of things. I need to order one piece of equipment. Oh, here's my kitty cat. Here's my kitty cat. Do you want to come in, sweetie? Hey, baby. Do you want to come in? And I also am going to order the new lipsticks from Give Beauty by Gwen Stefani at Sephora. And I'm going to order... This is still a mess. That's still on the list. But I'm going to order some counter stools, like bar stools for the counter. Um, because like I said, I did buy some pictures to put here. And I'm going to put some, buy some baskets or something to fix there. Do you want to come in, sweetie? Or do you not want to come in? Oh, little baby. You look sleepy. So, and then I'm going to fix, because I have my two videos from New York, I edited, I edited those yesterday, so I'm going to do the thumbnail in the description box, because they're already up on YouTube, and I'm going to have both of those live today, one on my vlog channel, and one on my main channel, I was thinking I was going to have a vlog live yesterday, but then we went out with the dogs, so it didn't happen, that was a neighbor's dog that you saw, are you coming sweetie, are you coming, hi baby girl, hi baby, are you coming, Mm -hmm. Are you coming, sweetie? Do you want some food? You said it. Do you want some food? Mommy will fix that. Mommy will fix that. I'm a little bit sad. We met our neighbors a couple of nights ago. Neighbors that we don't we don't talk to them. We don't really know them. And now I really don't want to know them. And they were saying that their little dog has gone missing. And we went to look for it a little bit, we didn't see it. Uh, and then, since then, Ricardo has seen this dog almost every day. And he's told the owners every day, this is where your dog is. But it is afraid of me, so I cannot catch it. You need to go there yourselves. And you need to go get your dog. It's by this tree. But the owners never did. And today, Ricardo found the dog dead. I'm so sad. I can't believe you would leave your dog like that. Who does that? Oh my god. Had I known they were not gonna go look for their dog but try and catch it, I would have put so much more effort into catching it myself. I just never thought someone would leave their dog. I just, I just wish we would put more effort and caught it ourselves. I can't believe someone left their dog to die. Maybe we should have brought treats or something so it wasn't afraid of us, I don't know. It's just, ne it never came up to us. It was just too scared. <sighs> so sad. Ricardo was so angry. <laughs> he should be. Like he literally told the owners, "This is where the dog is. Please go get your dog, cause he's afraid of us." And that's exactly where we found the dog today. And he was so mad. And I'm just so sad. Oh, I wish we would have tried harder. I just didn't think the owners wouldn't. Get him. I surely hope they never get a dog again. I'm sorry, I just, I don't know, it's just so weird. And I'm not, I don't want to bring this to, like, as a Swede, but like, it's so expensive to get a dog in Sweden. Nobody leaves their dog like this. And I'm not saying it's just money, but it's like, I don't know. I just never have heard of anything like that before in my life. It just made me really sad. I just wish I knew that stuff like this could happen. And then we would have tried harder. I just never thought that they wouldn't go get him. Oh my god. 
I was gonna film. <laughs> I was gonna film. <sighs> I'm still gonna try and film it. I'm really sad. At least I learned something today. I just I felt sad <laughs> so I decided to just play some lol eat some yogurt have another cup of coffee and just try to think about something else for a bit I I always say that I'm rather naive I'd, I'd rather be naive than cynical but I think in this situation it might have served me better to be cynical because maybe then I I would have realized that they were not gonna go look for their pet. I mean, if someone told me Tesla's been under this tree, I've seen him several times, but he's been too afraid. Listen, I'd be camping under that tree. That'd be me camping under that tree until he came back, because I would never want any of my pets to think that I abandoned them, that I didn't go looking for them. So it just taught me something about people and it just made me very sad. Um, I'm just, it's just, I don't know. I never thought that this was a lesson that I needed to know about people, but yeah, not everyone loves their pets the way that I love my pets, and I just, I just feel like I could have done more, and I feel stupid now for not realizing that sooner, but I've been in the shower, I'm gonna film, <laughs> it, it needs to get done. I am done filming. I have filmed two videos and I just took off my top because it was so warm but yeah I've filmed two videos it is a bit of a mess here but this is the makeup look this is what it looks like fairly pleased with it so I am gonna see if I can get all of this footage on my computer and I'm also gonna see if I can maybe edit a video for tomorrow because I kind of want to take a half day off tomorrow because I am waiting for some things to arrive that I want to film with so there's no I have nothing really to film tomorrow so I think I'm gonna take half a day off tomorrow and if I do a little editing today I have a meeting tomorrow before lunch so maybe after that meeting I could be done and I could be by the pool in that floaty that I bought I'm excited about that so yeah I'm gonna see if I can pack up this mess a bit and I wonder when Ricardo's coming home. I'm not 100% sure if he's coming like late or early. Because he's just done with a project in at work. So usually he works a little less when he's like finished up a project. So <sighs> yeah, hopefully we'll be back soon. He was in a really bad mood this morning, of course, just like me. So maybe we can like, I don't know, chat about that a bit as well. But I'm going to be fixing this mess. <laughs> We went to the grocery store. Always when we go to a grocery store, we're like, oh, I'm just gonna buy this one thing. And then like $120 later. <laughs> we end up buying all of the things, like pizza and snacks. And no, I would never leave you in the forest. I would be under that tree all day. Mm. You got the southern peach lemonade. I don't want to. Frozen <laughs> stuff first. Hmm? Frozen stuff first. No, but I'm, I'm showing my lemonade. I got lemonade. Oh, and I got lime snacks. Are these good? Well, I'll find out soon when I. It's a salty lemon. No, salty limon. My Spanish is not ideal. Yes, and we bought some frozen stuff.
Oh, and I bought ice cream, the minty one. It says light, so that I feel better about myself. But it's the mint chip one. And Ricardo got another one. The one that is pecan pretty, because he likes that. Oh yeah, and some breakfast burritos. We've never tried that. So we're doing that, you think. Here's one more. Oh, and some pizza. Because some nights you do not want to cook, and then it's nice to have some pizzas at home. Oh, and here are the snacks that we part about. They are Texas corn, chili, and lemon. And your sweet tea. Unsweet tea. <laughs> Bye. And my favorite, Coke syrup. That's basically it. We're gonna cook. Oh, I still need to charge my battery, so I'm gonna do that. But we are gonna cook because we have a recipe left. We have this one. It's quesadillas. So we are gonna make quesadillas. Hopefully it will be yummy. And I'm gonna need to charge my camera. And I will see you. I'll see you in a bit. Okay, we are done with the food. I'm gonna show you what we're eating. We are gonna watch, what is it actually called? The, the Boba Fett series. The Book of Boba Fett, right? Mm -hmm. I think it's called that. We haven't had Disney Plus for a while because we canceled it when we were moving because we were moving to another region. And then we got it again. And we haven't watched either that one or the Obi-Wan Kenobi one. So we have a bunch of things to catch up on. So I'm super excited about that. I think somebody else is eating here as well. Look at this one. He's like, I'm about that food. Let me show you what we made. Um, this part of the video is not sponsored by HelloFresh, even though I do work with HelloFresh at times. I just want to make it clear this is just us eating HelloFresh because it's delicious. And we made quesadillas for the first time ever. So this is mine and this is Ricardo's. And we've never made this before. So it is vegetarian quesadillas. And we are gonna watch um, Disney Plus. Good morning, I thought. Uh, I'm waiting for my coffee and I thought while I'm waiting for my coffee I can show you the two packages that came in last night but my battery on my uh, one camera was dead so I thought I'd show you now this is my leave order and I just opened this one because the package was so warm so I was like did this melt so I got two more half lashes these are intense and smoky I know because I bought them these are my favorite half lashes from Vive they're a bit more dramatic, which is something that I really like when I'm doing half lashes. Then I bought one more lipstick, and this is the one that was almost melted. So I love the packaging. I got mine in, coming on, coming in hot. And I think it has, yeah, it has settled down a little bit now, but I had to like actually put it like in back because it, it's warm it's warm here and it was sitting outside waiting for me so this is the coming in hot unfortunately it's not pristine because yeah i had to push this one back but it is like an orangey brown and i am excited then i got the lip dew and they came up with some new colors so i got the one look at this it's like a warm peach this one is called pesca which is peach so i'm excited about that one and I got the face palette. They had a light one and a dark one, and I got the light one. This is what it looks like. I think it's fairly cute. And oh, there's a plastic here. Here's the inside. There's like a bronzer and two blushes, and this is a highlighter. It looks nice. It looks really cute. Um, I'm excited. I'm excited to be trying this one out. Um, I think I'm gonna like it. I don't usually do a lot of face palettes, but I gotta say, there's just, this one from Vive, it just looked really pretty, and I like the packaging. I also got, let me put this one down. A PR package from Wee Makeup. So it came in this one. And they are releasing some more of their super, super shiny, sparkly shadows. I don't know if these are in focus. Yes, honey. How can I help you? You're being ridiculous. So they're coming out with a blue and like a reddish peach. Oh, this pink and a, a lavender. And 
Ooh, and an olive green and like a goldy pink. And they also sent me some of these to put them in. They have this really cute mini empty palace. There are three. So you can make your like your own mini palette from Wee Makeup. I got two of them to put these in. And they're like just a little trio and it has a mini mirror here. I think that this is honestly so cute. If you're the kind of person that reapplies makeup or brings your makeup with you, these little trio ones are amazing and these look so nice. Let me see if I can actually show you a little better with the camera because this isn't 100% ideal. It's really hard to capture these because they are so silver in the packaging, but these are the shades. This is the lavender. And you can see they have like little sparkly specks in them. Ooh. But they are really pretty and we makeup makes really really nice eyeshadows. So I'm excited to be trying these out and to put them in the packaging. Maybe we'll be able to see them better if I do put them in the packaging. I'm also going to fix my nails today. And I'm thinking I'm only going to work until lunch today. Because I have a meeting at 11 and I think after that I'm going to take a pool break before nail appointment. So I moved myself to the pool. I think I deserve this. I think I deserve a day at the pool. It's not a day, it's after lunch. I have been doing my videos. I have been doing today's video, tomorrow's video. I've been doing some editing and I had a meeting which was very successful, which is a very good meeting. I have a couple of follow-up things that I need to fix. I have a couple of mails that I should really, really, really look into. But you know what? That is not today later tonight or probably tomorrow. Mm. Okay, so I'm back from doing my nails. Let me see if I can show you. I did a, oof, that is bright. I did like a neon tip, Go Pride Month. I thought they were really, really cool. But look at this, my sandals are here. I know it cut off a little bit at the end of my other vlog, the one from New York at the, at the end. My editing software was basically like, no bitch, this is all you get. But I did buy a pair of acne sandals, but they didn't have my size in. It's Acne Studios. Oh, there's a kid again. It's Acne Studios and they didn't have my size in. So they said that they will send me my size from the warehouse. And now they are here. It is the pink box here. Honey, can you help me film? Can you tell about the excitement? Please? Anyways, before he comes over, here is the box. And here, maybe you can see my nails a little better. Maybe you can't. Hello? This is what they look like. I think they're really cool. Come help me. Okay, let me show you what they look like. They did come with two different dust bags. Sometimes with like designer shoes, you do get two dust bags, one for each shoe. I'm surprised that these came with these shoes because they're not that expensive. And this is what the sandals look like. I, I packaged them again so that I, it could look like... Why are you sniffing up my butt? Sir, sir, I'm gonna need you to stop. Okay. I, I packed them again so it would look like they're, they're new again, but I did wear them. <laughs> I did try them, but yeah, this is what they look like. I describe these as a, like a, I don't know, a grungy uh, like Birkenstock or an edgy Birkenstock. I think they are super cool and I'm so happy that we're wearing these this summer. Do you like them? Yeah, they're cute. This is not a very nice shot. Do you like them? You approve? Yes. Thank you. Okay, let's fix the, let's fix the, the thingamajig. Let me show you. Let's fix the thingamajig over here. I think I did show you before. So we're gonna put this one up on the wall, but of course this is not the, the, the picture we're gonna have. The picture is still 
and packaging. So we need to fix that. So I think that's like the last thing that we're gonna try and make make work for today before maybe, I don't know, watching Star Wars and eating some leftovers from yesterday. Okay, so the frame that we bought is a little bit smaller than the actual picture. So we're just trying to measure a little bit. So we end up getting it somewhat not crooked. That is the goal, right? Mm -hmm. Not crooked. <laughs> Look, here she is. And yes, it is Princess Amidala. Oh, I love it. I will link this print down below because I did buy it quite recently. The frame is from At Home, but this print is so pretty. It's called the Red Queen and it is just perfect. It's just perfect here. I love it. I love it so much. Actually, this yellow one here is not supposed to be here. Uh, we're gonna have that on a different cabinet that we're getting in the future. We're still just deciding on which one we are getting. So yeah, that yellow one, it's it's a it's a visitor. It, it doesn't live here. <laughs> that I'm using right now these are from Bellamy but I haven't colored them in yet so they are actually like you can see the roots are a little bit too light for me because I haven't colored them in but I'm gonna do that as soon as like I have time I'm gonna fix that so they are more perfect um, but yeah I'll get to that with time but I'm gonna film my new makeup releases today so exciting I can't believe it's already Thursday isn't that a little crazy time like flies Oh my god, I'm drinking my coffee, fixing today's video that's already up. And I also was ordering from House Labs because that is coming in. I ordered express shipping, so I think I'm going to get my package already on Friday. So I don't know if I'm going to do like a, I think I'm going to do like a bonus video. If it's coming early on Friday, I'm definitely doing a bonus video. Me and Ricardo are heading uh, to the domain doing a little shopping on saturday um so i don't know if i want to be filming then <clears throat> because we have like plans and our neighbors also recommended a ramen place close to the domain so we kind of want to try that out so i don't want to be like working on a saturday but if it comes in somewhat early on friday i might i might do it oh my god this angle is not like 100 percent perfect but here we are I was still thinking a little bit about the poor doggo this morning. I'm still feel sad about that. It's gonna take me some time to get over that. I feel like, oh sorry. I feel like me and Ricardo have talked about that so much lately. It's just such a sad situation. But yeah, I don't know. Sometimes you just have to roll with it. I can't change anything now. What is? <laughs> I'm like, where am I supposed to? So it's this one, right? And this one. Holy bananas. Here we are. But yeah, I'm just gonna fix my hair. And and film. Do many makeup releases. There are so many fun things to talk about this week. Like I'm honestly like so 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 excited. I bought some house labs. There are new lip pencils coming from what's your face? Um Oh my god, I forgot the name. I will, I will pop up the name of the brand on the screen right now. But I really want... Uh, uh, Kosas. I, I'm an idiot. Kosas. I really want to get those. The colors look really beautiful. So I really want to try some of those as well. I was hoping that those were going to be available as I ordered the house labs. But they were not. But I did buy the new LYS. Uh, the new LYS. And I the, the cream bronzer. And I also bought that leave-in conditioner from Sol de Janeiro. Because I was like, yes, I do need that. Uh, because leave-in conditioner is such a good thing to have for your extensions it like really makes a big difference for your extensions so I decided to try the Solutioner one so that my extensions can smell really yummy so yeah that's what I decided to get so that's what I ordered plus the house lamps but yeah maybe I'll even get the house lamps within 
uh, this vlog to be honest because yeah because we're coming on friday and i also have a sephora order coming in today we're gonna do some unboxings oh and when my sephora order comes in i can also show you because late last night i got my order in from unearthly cosmetics unearthly cosmetics so hard to say and those are things i bought myself so not pr i did end up buying a couple of palettes myself that they had that i didn't own because i wanted to own them so i'll show you those as well when my sephora order comes in i can show you all of it but yeah i'm just having a full work day ahead of me chugging along getting my work done i'll show you when everything looks like um with my eye makeup i want to do a really smoky look today and i have this like asymmetrical black dress that i want to wear so i think i'm gonna wear that today maybe my new prada earrings that would be a cool look will that look good with this hair maybe we'll see this has been quite a day i do have my makeup on i've had this on all day it is like what is the time uh, it is four or five o'clock i can't even tell but i have been working all day i've been filming two videos i've been editing answering a million trillion mails and yeah i still have a couple hours left of work but it's okay it's been i knew that today was going to be a day that was like a full full day but yeah I like the look though. I really wanted to go with something super smoky. But yeah, I haven't really been vlogging today because there's nothing to vlog. There's nothing to vlog. I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna show you what I get. My Sephora order was gonna come today. Like one of them. It doesn't matter because I won't have time to film with that until like Monday either way. But it says it was coming today and now it says it's coming tomorrow. And <laughs> my house lab says it's partially shipped which i will never understand um why they shipped half of my house beauty things it's like do you not even have the same brand in the same warehouse confusing very confusing but yeah if it gets there tomorrow i'll 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 do that but i'll show you my sephora order orders once it comes in tomorrow but i also have some palettes from unearthly like i told you i'll show you that in a bit as well and i did get some uh like the paintings or like the prints the what do, we, do you call them paintings even if not painted pictures for the wall they came from amazon so i'm going to show you those as well we're going to actually put them up like the bar stools that we ordered are not coming for a couple of weeks which is annoying but like it's fine it's fine I'll, have i have i survived for almost six months without them i think i'll survive a couple of more weeks but yeah today has been a lot so i'm actually the only reason why i'm getting up from the computer because i am Sitting there, I was actually looking at some of the new videos. I saw Samantha March just uploaded her like New York vlog. So I've been editing when you make it releases and I still have some time left on that one. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm a little bit tired, but I took a break because I need to get a snack. So I'm gonna go get a snack. And then I have like maybe two hours of work left. Maybe. Looky looky, here are the paintings that came from Amazon. I will link them down below. I think these are really cute um, and hold it tr all the trash So we are gonna put them here and this is where we're gonna have our bar stools as soon as they come They said June 28th Really excited about that Wow, you seem so excited. You're gonna stab me with that <laughs> <Dun -dun. laughs> So we are gonna put those paintings here, honey <laughs> and yeah it's gonna be all nice when we get those little bar stools there. and some kind of organization here that drives me absolutely bonkers I need to fix that as well but did you do some measurements no okay let's do it okay so the paintings are up and somewhat straight they're not perfect they're good enough i'm not the perfectionist though but i'm, I'm, I'm happy with this these look nice, right? Mm -hmm. They're gonna nice with the chairs as well <laughs> when they deliver them in three weeks. <laughs> I guess this is what free shipping means. Someone's walk walking them here. <laughs> Some like uh, school kid, this is their summer assignment. They're biking them over <laughs> from the warehouse. <laughs> but I like them. Like I said, I bought them at Amazon. I will link them down below. I think they're really cute. And look at this one. Someone's a little hungry. Is that you, tiger? Oh, maybe she's a little sleepy. So yeah, now we have, oh my God, look at this. Two paintings in two days. Well, this is three technically. The world is our oyster. <laughs> The 
avocado fancy up for pizza. What did you put on the pizza? Because we're eating a little bit of pizza. You put some extras on. Mm -hmm. Sage. Yeah, sage and garlic and some goat cheese, right? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. So it's like a vegetarian pizza that we bought done, but we just put some extras on. We, he put some extras on. I did the dishes. <laughs> but we're gonna have pizza and probably watch another episode of Boba Fett. Boba Fett. Um, yeah, so we can start watching the Obi-Wan. We're so behind. <laughs> This Friday has been a lot, but I got some packages in. I got some of my Sephora order in, but unfortunately not the part where I can film the house labs. So I've just been fixing a lot of other stuff, trying to reorganize this room a little bit. And then like, look at this pile here on the floor. This is just makeup that I'm actually gonna be giving away. I think, at least for now, I don't have like a use for it. But I thought I'd show you some things that have showed up in the mail. I did do my own order, I told you, from Unearthly Cosmetics. And I bought a couple of these like singles. These were empty, empty magnetic singles. And I put in a couple of my favorite highlighters and blushes from Unearthly. This is the pinky shimmery one. Then I put in the orange matte one. Just look at this packaging, it is so pretty. And the last one, I put the light highlighter, the one that's like a light gold. That's what I put in. And then I also ordered the Lore palette, the newly formulated one, because I really love the old one. And I wanted to have the new one because she has changed manufacturer ooh, to make her mattes even better. And this is the new Lore palette. It's the one that has Medusa on the front. So this is what it looks like. And I also got the Hauntingly Glamorous. This is in collaboration with, what's her name? Oh my god, I'm so, I feel so bad. I don't remember the name of the creator that they did this palette with. It doesn't say on the... Is that weird? They should probably put that. Why didn't they put that on the palette? They should really have done that. I would be so sad if someone like... Because now I don't know her name. I don't know her name. They should have put the name on the front. Why didn't they do that? Because now I don't know who it's with. It doesn't say anything, but this is the palette. I decided to get this one as well. I think it's really cute. It's like a little bit Halloween inspired. So I'm super excited to be having it because I didn't own it. I basically bought a bunch of uh, the unearthly palette that I didn't have. And then I decided to get the new one as well, the Fall Magic. This one had one broken shade that I tried to fix the best of my ability, but you can see I wasn't the best at fixing it, but I still think I did okay. This is a really more of fall inspired theme. Of course, it's called fall magic, but I don't really care what season we're in. I'll wear whatever I want. I just feel like this is a really nice muted color story that still I find a little bit intriguing and I've heard a lot of people really liking this one. So I thought that'd be fun. I also got my order in from... Fawn. If you watched my new makeup releases, you saw that I bought the orange, the glowy orange lip balm bundle. Is that what it's called? I've never tried this brand before. So this is the, is this the lip oil? It's called No Ma'am. <laughs> Recover, recovery and glow lip oil. Mmm, let me see. Mmm, okay. Doesn't taste like anything. I can be about that. That's really nice. And then there is a, what is this one called? I think this is a gloss, also orange, of course. This one has some shimmer in it. This is not as yellowy orange as the other one. This one is called Absolutely Not. And this is a, why don't people put what it is on the packaging? What is this? It just says directions. Literally, there is not a name on this. <sighs> Listen, indie brands, I love you. I, re I love you. But you have got to stop not putting on the packaging. What is it? What is this product? Is it a gloss? What is it? Literally, it doesn't say. Okay, here it says, it's the Fawn Beauty Serum Gloss. Uh, it's a lip uh, serum and a gloss. That's really nice. Mm, I just wish that they had it on the packaging as well. I might be picky, but it's like just those little things that you notice. So this is my Sephora order. <laughs> I got the 
Milky Leave-In. This is the Milky Leave-In Conditioner by Sol de Janeiro. I don't know. I can, t I can smell how nice it smells. I don't want to open that right now because I don't want to put it in my hair. I need to change clothes before going to the vet. We're going there in like 10 minutes. So I did get, I did get a Smashbox Halo Healthy Glow All in One to the Moisturizer. I've heard some really good things about this and they have recently released them in a mini. This is perfect. This is perfect. I got the mini. I got it in light medium. And here are the new colors from Give Beauty. I love that she's paying tribute to her OG Anaheim uh, bandana, like with the print on the inside. Really like the packaging of the Give Beauty lipsticks. So I decided to get this is Tragic Me. Oh, look at that nude. Look at that nude. Oh, I am excited. I am excited. And this is the Lovable Me. Oh, so this is a little darker. These look so nice. I listen, all the other ones looked really nice too, but at the same time, I have to be like, so what am I the most likely to use if we're gonna be a million percent honest? And it is nudes that are not pinky. So this is this is the only thing that got delivered out of my $350 Sephora order that had a one-day express delivery. This is what I got. So these are from House Labs. So these are the House Labs by Lady Gaga. Love. This is like white, but it still looks like recycled paper, like just a little bit lighter. You can see both of these have this recycled paper. You can see this is just a brown and this is just like an off white. And then the print here is like, you can feel it. It's like embossed. So this is the Edge Precision Brow Pencil. I got mine in taupe. Let's have a look, see at this one. I'm gonna, of course, try all this out when I have it, but ooh, this looks really sleek and nice. And it looks taupe as well, but I'm just gonna have to wait for the rest of my order. Mm, okay, this looks very, very, very promising. And I think there's a spoolie here, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, first impression, just based on how it looks, that looks really, really nice. Let me put that one in the other box. And then this one is the... Le Monster Lip Crayon in Peach Matte. This is apparently what I decided to get. Let me see what I got. Let me see what I got. Oh, okay. This packaging is looking like a really fancy fountain pen. What is this? This is just for show. Okay. Oh, and it's just a twist up. That looks nice too. And this color actually looks really nice. Okay. You know what? First impression. Just based on packaging and the look and the feel of these so far i'm intrigued i just wish that all of it had actually been delivered on friday like it said it was going to be but at least it gave me some time to clean up this mess so maybe i should be happy anyways i'm going to change my coats and i'm going to gather up the animals so we can go get get them their booster shots <laughs> they're not gonna get this we are heading to the vet with all three animals and I'm also feeling so sad because Semla gets very car sick. So yeah, that's not ideal. Poor kitty cat, but what are you gonna do? She has to get to go to the vet. Uh, I'm so sorry, I'm sorry, I know honey. And I mean we're in the US now and like our vet was like five minutes away from my apartment when we were in Sweden and now it's like a 20 minute drive with the car. It's not ideal. I feel bad for her, but Anyways, they need to get their booster shots for some kind of a, what vaccine was it? Oh, we don't know. Some kind of a vaccine that they don't get in that they don't get in Sweden. But yeah, that's what we're doing now. Front Friday night. drinking local cider i am watching kayla and i am playing the new set of league of legends and i'm thriving y'all keep asking me what i play in league of legends i play tft and then i watch the sims only. <laughs> 
thriving. We just made an order from the Cheesecake Factory. I'm, I'm filming this on my phone, but we just made an order from Cheesecake Factory and I'm thriving. If you're ever wondering like, what do you like about the US? Can I be super basic Betty and just say that I really like the Cheesecake Factory? I really do. And I like that they're on DoorDash and I bought a salad and cheesecake and like Ricardo bought some tacos and I'm just, I'm excited. I like, I like it. <laughs> I know I'm a basic Betty, but I like it. I really do. So yeah, I'm just gonna be playing some games. I'll put myself in line so that I can play. I'm trying to play ranked. Oh, look at me. I'm trying to play ranked, but I'm like silver two or something, silver three. I'm not thriving. Listen, I love this new set. I'm all about the dragons. I love the new set, but I'm kind of bad. So I'm trying to play with this one in the background. Have you played with the mobilitics? The add-on, I'm trying to play with that in the beginning so that I can learn some sets because I'm not doing the best. I'm trying to learn a couple of the sets in the beginning, otherwise I just will not be able to get through. What am I right now? Uh, it doesn't say. I think I'm silver too, but it's hard. It's really hard. But this is where I'm going to be. Looking forward to my food. a rainbow lower lash line i really like it i tried to be inspired by my own nails i didn't film it maybe i should i'm thinking i might i really like it though i'm trying out some new products just do my makeup for me we are heading to the domain to do a little shopping and our neighbors also recommended this ramen place that was close by but like in the area so we're gonna try that one out so yeah doing something fun for saturday fun for me are you excited are you excited <laughs> well, we're gonna get you new sunglasses, that's fun. You had those sunglasses longer than you had me. <laughs> and my ex, and the ex before that, and that ex before Are you telling me that you can trust no one but these sunglasses? <laughs> Clearly these sunglasses need to be changed because you've been with me for what, six years and your ex for seven years, so... shopping trip i did buy some underwear at victoria's secret and i bought a couple of t-shirts and then i bought two things at nordstrom so let me show you i actually bought a hydro flask i've been wanting to have one of these to have at like the office like the office but by computer and also to bring to the pool because i want to try and drink more water because i actually don't really like water i know that's shameful and then i got a scented candle i did smell this one with samantha march when i was in las vegas and then i showed it to ricardo now and he really liked it too so i decided to get it this is Vulu spa Vulu spa i don't know how to pronounce that and this is the kalahari watermelon it's like a tangy watermelon and i think we're gonna have it down here downstairs are you happy we're back <laughs> are you happy we're back <laughs> Pizza. I am wearing this dress. I think it's. I want to say last year, Sora. I'm wearing my Gia shoes, and I think they're Gia Borghini. I think she might be Italian, and my cinnamon bag. Still wearing the same makeup as I did before. Are you having a t-shirt on? You're more casual than me. I just wanted to dress up. We're having pizza. Yes, and I'm having pizza dressed up. Soupy. Happy Sunday! 
I am editing. I've actually been filming. I got the house labs in. So I have been filming. Because uh, I want to have that video up tomorrow. Monday. This video is probably also going up um, tomorrow. So you'll be able to probably already see that. That video is probably already live as this one is going live. Or maybe I'll put this vlog up on Tuesday. I'm not 100% sure. But yeah. I decided to make Sunday a bit of a work day. Because house labs showed up. And... I, it showed up quite early as well, like in the morning. So I decided to film it. I've already filmed it. It is two o'clock and I am in the middle of editing it now. And I'm just going to have it uploaded. So tomorrow morning over coffee, which is what I like. I like having a big cup of morning coffee in the morning when I'm working. And just like fixing today's video. Doing a thumbnail, fixing the description box and everything. So I've been trying not to make up. If you're interested, that video is already live on my channel. I also had... Like a small vlog fragment thing imaging from New York left, which was what I wore during my weekend in New York. I'm also gonna edit that. I'm gonna see if I can get that up actually tonight. Um, and fix that. And I also edited a thing because I am uh, joining. I'm gonna have some of my videos uh, on a Facebook page in a bit. Um, so they are gonna like fix that for me. So I just actually filmed like an intro thing for that. It's called Just Like That Beauty. Uh, some other creators on there as well it's gonna be really fun to see how that works out reaching another audience if you search for just like that beauty on facebook you can join the group and see some other creators there i think it looks really nice the team has been very helpful so i just filmed a little intro so i'm gonna fix that as well so since i am working on a sunday which i normally don't i'm gonna give myself one of the days off this week it's not gonna be monday because i have a lot of things to do on monday I, it's gonna be either Tuesday or Wednesday. Tuesday or Wednesday I'm gonna take off because on Thursday I need to film my new makeup releases and edit and on Friday of course I'm fixing my new makeup releases. So either Tuesday or Wednesday I'm gonna take off like next week. Maybe be at the pool. Also look at these. It's from Ketchup Fantasy again. Uh, it's the Millennium Falcon earrings. They're so cute. I felt like I wanted to wear them. And this is one of the t-shirts I bought yesterday. Hold your horses. It's so cute. But we are, uh, one of Ricardo's co-workers is coming here today. I'm going to give her some makeup that I have left over, some makeup and skincare. I'm also uh, draw my giveaway winner. Hopefully she will come back to me soon. And I think I'm going to have another giveaway maybe next week again. Because I have some more things that I want to give away. Like I have some stuff from Lunar Beauty that I want to give away. So keep your eyes open for another giveaway. But we're also doing a little doggy meetup tonight. So I will definitely bring you to that at least. Because we have a lot of neighbors here that we get along with. Like we went to dinner last night with our neighbors. I showed you we went to this Mexican place. And... Uh, we also have some other neighbors, quite a few that has the dogs, and they're really friendly, so we're doing a little, like, a dog play date. <laughs> Sometimes in a week, uh, weekend night, because it's a little too warm during the night. So we're doing that tonight, so I'll bring you along. But yeah, the week is coming to an end. This did not end up to be a off Sunday, but I'll, I'll do a pool, pool Tuesday or a pool Wednesday, but yeah. I'm gonna keep editing the house labs. If you're interested in house labs, like I said, it's already on my main channel. The sun is going down. It is Sunday night. Look at this beautiful. And we are at, this is like a greener part of the place where we're living. And we are just gathering with a couple of our neighbors and we are just like having our dogs play a bit because in this heat, it's really hard to have the dogs out playing. You can't really have them out during the daytime. So. We're gathering here once a week, something that Ricardo started when we moved here so that the dogs can play together and just get some energy out without being too overheated because the sun is setting now. So I'm going to end the vlog here. Thank you so much for watching this video. Thank you so much for watching the vlog. Um, and I will see you in my next vlog, which is hopefully going to be real soon. And the house labs, it's still going on strong. I kind of like this makeup. I kind of like it. I'm a little bit sweaty. You see, some of this you're seeing, it's not highlight. It's sweat. Anyways, I'll see you in my next vlog. And I hope you have a great day. Bye.